everyone. Back here again today with the CS590 Timber Pup. Today we're going to be working on cutting up this, uh, this is a, uh, a Spanish Southern Red Oak. So, for some reason here in Texas when we get a real dry year like it was this past year, quite a few of these will get rot in the center of them and they'll end up falling over in the pasture. There's one further back in the pasture here. The base of that tree is about 24 inches across. So that's going to be another video. We're going to be working on this one today. I just want to make a, a quick statement. Uh, on my second video of doing tree cutting, I had said that live oak was the same as white oak. That is not correct. Technically, live oak is a member of the red oak family. So just wanted to clear that up. So cold start. Here we go.
just love cameras, they end up shutting off on me. So I think I'm getting towards the uh, the end of my memory for videos, so I might just delete some stuff. So what ended up happening here is the storage space. So it cut off the footage while I was limbing the tree. And then I went over to the camera to check on it to get set up for bucking the tree and saw that it was off. So I got this camera going again and it only gave me about three minutes. So I do have a couple more of these trees in the pasture. Uh, one of them I plan on cutting up pretty soon. The other one, as you heard me talk about, is probably about 24 inches on the base. That one I have to wait until probably February before I can touch that one because it's close to the hunting area on the ranch and we don't want to disturb the hunters while they're hunting for deer and stuff. So if you're uh, liking what you're seeing, please give me a thumbs up. Um, enjoy the rest of this video and I'll catch you on the next one. Mm-hmm. <laughs>